Is your boy <coughs> is your boy Ray here with another one? Samson Joe Dirt Joe Dirt Samson. Uh Joe Dear Tay. Uh my man Samson dropped this shit in uh when I was on vacation. So I said fuck it. Listen. <laughs> I may I may or I may have not. Ate a gummy. I, I'm going to let you guys be the judge of it. You explain to me what's going on. Like, comment, subscribe, do all that. Federico, what's going on, buddy? You chilling? Cut the beat. <laughs> Thank you. Federico's a funny looking motherfucker, bro. <laughs> Nigga, leave, bro. Leave. Oh, my God. Samson. Samson. Samson, <laughs> Joe Dear Tay, it is on you. Fly, uh, motherfucker, but I'm looking like Joe Dirt. When I pull up with the mullet, make your whole squirt. Motherfuckers always make. I ain't gonna lie to you, man. I'm in the country. Like, I'm in the country, country, right? Uh, the mullet, the mullet, like, I, at first, I was just like, yo, what happened? Dude? They, yo, these niggas fucked his hair up. <laughs> like, yo, yo, you just came from the barber? What did you tell them you wanted? I was concerned. And they were like, yo, it's a mullet. And I was just like, and I didn't know what a mullet truly was. A mullet is like, there's like mullet societies out here and shit. And a mullet is business in the front, a party in the back. That's what I heard. <laughs> and then I'm, I'm looking at it. I'm looking at, at, um, at Samson's mullet. And I can see, yo, I can understand. Like, if you look at just the top of his head and his eyebrows and his eyes, that's a, that's a respectable kid. He goes to church. He helps old ladies with groceries and shit. He does all types of nice things for the community. But if you look at the back, like, yo, this nigga owns a gun. <laughs> so I, I, I can understand it. I can see it. I can see the attraction of a mullet. Yeah, but what I need Samson to do is, <clears throat> I need you to, the the <clears throat> the up part, not the mo, the up part. The it part. That part. I need you to braid it and then keep it casual up front and then bring back the stash. I don't know why you shaved that caterpillar off there, but I I think you heard some of the comments. <laughs> I was worried for you. Usually when a nigga goes through a mustache stage, it's because he don't know who he is. <laughs> I love Samson, man. <laughs> Fly motherfucker, but I'm looking like Joe Dirt. When I pull up with the mullet, make your whole squirt. Motherfuckers right. always making fun of me, but guarantee when nobody's around, they're gonna study me like homework. Never ah. bought a bitch a fur coat or a coach. Ah. <laughs> I'm just I like I don't understand like why you always why do rappers always make other lady, uh, other people's women squirt? Like that's it's not your job to make a squirt, bro. Like that's the husband's job to make a squirt. Uh, why don't you get your own girlfriend? And you just tell your girl, hey. I want to make you squirt. I guarantee she's going to be like, yes, babe, after church. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Me, but guarantee when nobody's around, they're gonna study me like homework. Never nah. bought a bitch a fur coat or a coach. I like that though. When nobody's, when none of these niggas is around, and they gonna study me like homework. Mm, simple, right to the point. Bah, hit the nose, little leakage. 
curse. I don't even try to flirt. She's the one who spoke first. I just show up at a house randomly and get to oh, work. Motherfuckers always making fun of me, but guarantee when nobody's around, they're gonna study me like homework. Never bought a bitch a fur coat or a coat's purse. I don't even try to flirt. She's the one who spoke first. I just right. show up at a house randomly and give the bitch a couple inches out of nowhere like a gross spurt. <laughs> Couple inches, <laughs> a couple inches, <laughs> like a gross spurt. <laughs> a gross, like you know, oh, you gained a couple inches. You must have had a gross spurt. Ah, uh, fuck you. Remember, like remember, you have like a little cousin or a nephew or somebody that you haven't seen since they were like a baby, and then you finally see them and be like, yo, when I first, when I when last time I saw you, you were like fucking three foot dumb nigga. Now you about like six foot this nigga. That is amazing. And then you just like, it's shut up, nigga. I grew. It happens, man. It happens. Niggas always asking me questions. How you got so big? Because I grew. Why are you bringing back old times, though? I hate it. When I hit my growth spray, everybody had to make a comment on it. I was like, all right, well, next time I see you, if that mustache gets any bigger, I'm going to comment on it. Aunt Belinda. <laughs> Who spoke first? I just show up at a house randomly and give the bitch a couple inches out of nowhere like a gross ah. spurt. Two twelves in my trunk, shake the whole earth. Po po told me turn it down, but it won't work. When I not in that car, my nigga. You put two twelves. You could put two twelves in that car, and you could say, "Oh, I'm gonna put dynamite in it." So the nigga is going to vibrate. The only way you're gonna be shaking the earth is because your car's gonna be shaking like a motherfucker, it's rattling and making all times to know to see that little light you got up there. It's gonna pop right out, my brother. I swear to God. I swear to God, give it a couple of months. Do not put it in that car. I I do this. I do. I've been doing this for seventeen years. Don't put that in the car. In that car. So what is that? A Ford Taurus sedan. You gotta you gotta stock radio, bro. You can't connect two subs in the stock radio. You're gonna need to get the seven inch uh, LCD screen, touch screen, Bluetooth. That's what you need. It goes in and out. So when you're done using it, but I close it. It's, uh, uh, robotics, my nigga. You gotta get an amp. You gotta, get a, you gotta put a capacitor. You have to find a dude to install it to tuck the wires in. And then if you do all that correctly and you tune it properly and everything is good, you give it the base test, you do all that. And then on top, it's still a Ford. <laughs> it's gonna shake the door panels off, bro. Oh, uh, you're gonna be driving around like Joe Dirt for real. <laughs> like a gross spurt, two twelves in my trunk, shake the whole earth. Po po told me turn it down, but it won't work. When right. I drove by your home, all of the artwork hung on your wall, fell off harder than smoke perk. Hitting lows while the tweeters in the bows chirp. Got a freak sitting shotgun, wearing no skirt. Put the seat back, turn the music up and cool slow while I get some road hit. Congresswoman Bo Bird. She was Congresswoman who? My nigga. Oh, that's disgusting, man. How you made my, my whole imagination confused as fuck, my nigga. My imagination got... Because he said shorty do what was bent over with her ass out. Giving that nigga slow, slow head. And, you know, you automatically you're like, oh, yo, she got a fatty. She's one of the country girls with the Dixie shorts, you know, and 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 the and the camouflage with the titties out, and she's giving you slow head. And you say, Congresswoman, who? It made my whole imagination become a whole entire nightmare. She gonna gum your ass down, bro. Teeth, put it inside a cup. <laughs> I hope you got a, a cup that you don't want no more, my nigga, because she's gonna be sleeping over. She's gonna have. She's gonna need a cup for her teeth. You can't put it in a plastic. It's gotta be a glass cup because she has to look at her teeth, man. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Was sucking on my balls like a gumdrop Made my toes curl, had my stomach in a knot I busted my nuts, sitting at a red light I said, damn bitch, really made me come to a stop I returned the f <laughs> He's skinny and I don't, I don't support that message See, Roe Ed uh, covers about 0.23% Of the uh, automotive, auto, automotive deaths In America Like 
I get it, but at the same time, if I'm driving, right, if I'm driving down the road and there's another car next to me and we had a stoplight, and we always in that area, like, yo, it's a, it's a long-ass stoplight. Like, it, it doesn't change. You feel like it's been red forever. And then you and then I turn over, and then I see you do this, and then all I see is cheeks in the air on the passenger seat. Like, that's going to cause a lot of, a, a lot of situations. It's going to cause a lot of situations. What happens if a truck sees the same thing I'm seeing, and, but he forgot to wear the brake that, and he has the gas, and then he crushes me and you? And then you're going to find you getting slow head from an old-ass lady. With your balls, and I'm like, yo, yo, what? Your jelly beans? What the fuck you call them? <laughs> he called them, like, them shit's juju beans, bro. <laughs> yes, multitaskers. <laughs> Congresswoman Boebert, she was sucking on my balls like a gumdrop, made my toes curl, a had my stomach drop. in a knot, I busted my nuts, sitting at a red light, I said, damn bitch, really made me come to a stop, That's I returned fire. a favor and I munched on her box, threw her legs to the side and put my tongue in her twat, shit. Uh oh, <laughs> oh my goodness, that was so graphic, <laughs> yo, what are you doing in life right now, bro? It, all this happened in the car. All this happened in the car. My brother, the, the, the front, like those seats are comfortable. I ain't gonna lie to you. There's many, I own that car. There's many times that I sat in that seat high as fuck. And that fucking seat felt like a fucking cloud, bro. I was flying. I get it, but you can't be doing all that in the front seat. You had to take it to the back seat at some point in this interaction. Because you flipping this old lady around inside a car. A four-door sedan is not the place to do it. There's motels that take cash $49.99 a night. <laughs> that poor lady, man. <laughs> Golly. Let's see what he did to her again. Because he gave he gave detailed instructions. Come to a stop. I returned the favor and I munched on her box. Threw right. her legs to the side and put my tongue in her twat. Shit looked like a water park when I got done. Had to stop at Walmart to get a sponge and a mop. Ugh. If you that nigga with the Walmart. Got aisle 17, my nigga. I also tell you, you got yourself the magic mop and you get yourself the bucket that goes with the magic mop. Bucket with the magic mop by $14.99. That's on sale. That's on sale. That's not all the time. That shit goes up sometimes. And then you go get the mop. The mop is going to be a special occasion type shit. Because you can buy the mop, right? The whole setup. And it comes with a mop. Uh, uh, the actual the actual mop. Comes with the pole and the mop. But check this out. Hit that button real quick. See how that shit fell? It's interchangeable. There's going to be a time where that shit's going to look like an old lady's wig. <laughs> and you can't mop shit no more with it. You're going to have to change it at some point. You can't always rinse and repeat with this shit. It carries bacteria. It carries smell. It, you, know, you, you have to get rid of it at some point. Interchangeable. Click, click. You don't ever have to buy a stick again, my guy. I'm just saying the magic mop is real and available at Walmart or Walmart, even your friendly neighborhood market. Puppets don't got it. <laughs> Looked like a water park when I got done. Had to stop at Walmart to get a sponge and a mop. Ah. If you feel me, holla lady. The rap game's lonely because I'm killing all you lately. I flee the murder scene and I pill off in a Mercedes with the windows rolled down, bumping million dollar baby. Ah. Trying to get more plays than Tommy Richmond till I got a million dollars in my palms. I'm clinching. Trying to ah. put my mom and dad in the bomber's pad so they don't got to give a fuck about a job description. Ah. Knocking on the door like bang, bang, who's this? If they don't open up, then I'ma spray flames through it. Everyone inside will have to vacate, move it. I never ask questions, I just take aim, shoot it. If they hate, and on me is cause they can't do it Gonna be great cause I'm making great A music Bunch of lame motherfuckers They just can't hang with it Cause I'm best in class like a straight A student Every time uh, uh, Best in class like a grade A student I was getting my C's and B's For a lot of you So I wanted two A's in my time It was mainly C's and B's It was mainly C's I was a middle, not, I was a middle type nigga Like I knew some shit But then I knew some shit right it's different. Go ahead, talk your shit, Sam. Go ahead. He's, he's, he's about done with y'all haters. Y'all over here talking stupid shit about him. Let, let's keep it a buck. Let's keep it 100%. 
There's no way that anyone could sit here right now and say that Samson, the Samson does not have lyrical ability or talent. Nobody could say that. They'll be lying if they're saying that. Flat out hate him. And this is why I think there should be incognito rappers on YouTube and shit like that. I think they, they should they should be incognito. Like you don't know what they look like. They wear a mask and gloves the whole fucking time you see them. No one knows what color they are. They just rap. So like that, you can't judge by color or by how a person looks. And just listen to the music. And then just judge off of what he's saying. You see how it's different? Did you did you go there for a little bit? Did you see how that was different? How it really didn't matter? That's just getting old as fuck, bro. For real, for real. Who's this? If they don't open up, then I'ma spray flames through it. Right. Everyone inside will have to vacate, move it. I never ask questions, I just take aim, shoot it. If they hating on me, it's cause they can't do it. Gonna be great, cause I'm making great A music. Bunch of lame motherfuckers, they just can't hang with it. Cause I'm best in class, like a straight A student. Right. Every time I see you on the stage, they boo it. It would be a miracle if they take to it. You're bottom of the barrel, but you swear you're on the top. About to put a stop to it like I drink great fluid. Ain't pulling no tricks, bitch, I came to stunt. No pat. That was a whole... Hold on, bro. Hold on, bro. You ain't gonna be doing that shit to me. Not on a fucking uh, Tuesday before a hurricane. A music, bunch of lame motherfuckers. They just can't hang with it. Cause I'm best in class like a straight A student. Right. Every time I see you on the stage, they boo it. It would be a miracle if they take to it. You're bottom of the barrel, but you swear you're on the top. About to put a stop to it like I drink break fluid. Ain't pulling no tricks, bitch. I came to stop. About to put up a stop like I drink break fluid. That's crazy. Oh. Because brake fluid, the way the system with brake fluid goes, uh, you got a master cylinder and you got a, 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 a power brake booster. The booster and the master cylinder work in unison with the brake system. So if you have no liquid in your brake fluid reservoir and your brakes feel a little funny, there's an issue. Before you spend all types of money, you put a little bit of brake fluid in there, you pump the brakes, and you see what it does. Does it get harder? Or does it get, or does it, does it still feel like a, a fucked up pedal? Huh? It feels better? You were low on brake fluid. Late, brake fluid doesn't dissipate, so this is where there's a problem. If you're low on brake fluid, it means that you're leaking it. And if it's not leaking, from your wheels, then it could be leaking inside of the power brake booster. The only way to find out what's going on is taking the master cylinder out and checking the booster. If there's fluid inside the booster, there's your leak, the booster went out. So you need booster, I would recommend changing it with the master cylinder and then getting a full brake flush around. If does that seem like something you could do today? Nigga, I do this shit for a living. Stop playing with these niggas, bro. <laughs> Every time I see you on the stage, they boo it. It would be a miracle if they take to it. Right. Bottom of the barrel, but just swear you're on the top. About to put a stop to it like I drink great fluid. Ain't pulling no tricks, bitch. I came to stunt. No pad so sharp, I got paper cuts. When you listen to me spit, it's kind of. Yeah, 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 yeah. Stop it. <laughs> that hurt my horse. <laughs> In class like a straight A student Every time I see you on the stage they boo it It would be a miracle if they take to it You're bottom of the barrel but you swear you're on the top About to put a stop to it like I drink great fluid Ain't pulling no tricks bitch I came to stunt No pad so sharp I got paper cuts When you listen to me spit it's kind of like deer hunting Cause you know you're always gonna get a bang for your buck Cause a buck is a fucking deer man <laughs> Cause a buck is a fucking deer, bro. Bang for your buck. Damn, Samson. Damn, Samson. That he just got that car clean. That car wasn't that car wasn't that clean before he recorded this. 
We all know that, that the carpet looked vacuum as fuck. Ain't nobody keeping their car that clean. He had a bag full of trash. <laughs> he had a can of dip. <laughs> when you listen to me speak. He had a can of dip and bush. <laughs> Bunch of cans, bushes, and dips, and all types of shit. McDonald's food, Taco Bell, Mountain Dew cups, cans. You know, all types of shit. And, and like bullets. <laughs> and just empty bullet cases. Like, he's just sitting there for no reason. <laughs> you got about two to three uh, camouflage hats rolled up in there. One is brand new that you just bought because you liked it, but you never wore it. <laughs> Huh? Those seats look shiny as fuck, though. You just wiped them down. Stop talking to me, bro. <laughs> Stop talking to me, bro. I don't want to hear it. <laughs> oh, my goodness, man. Look, and I guarantee you know how I know? Because look at the steering wheel. That man has that car for three years. You're telling me the steering wheel's not going to have no, no. No rub marks on him. You telling me steering wheel ain't gonna have no rub mark? There's not one. He had a he had a, a, a steering wheel cover, and when he was about to shoot this video, he said, "I'm taking this shit off because the thread started coming out. So it's all bunch. It's all fucked up. It started peeling because it was those like racing leather ones. And he was, he thought it was cool. He bought it. It was cheap. It was on clearance. Then he put it on there. And it looked cool for about a day. <laughs> <laughs> I'll let you guys be the judge to see how hard is this gummy hit. <laughs> Hold on. Miracle if they take to it. Your bottom of the barrel, but just swear you're on the top. About to put a stop to it like a drink, break fluid. Ain't yeah. pulling no tricks, bitch. I came to stunt. No pad so sharp, I got paper cuts. I ain't pulling no tricks. I I came to stunt, stunt, tricks, tricks, stunt. He's a stunt man. God, man, evil Knievel ass. Get out. Okay, his song, Evil Knievel. Oh, see how niggas be putting shit together like that when they use their brain? <laughs> man, Slap Happy's not even going to be the title of this. It's something else. <laughs> I drink great fluid, ain't pulling no tricks, bitch. I came to stunt. No pad so sharp, I got paper cuts. When you listen to me spit, it's kind of like deer hunting, because you know you're always going to get a bang for your buck. Fire. Fire, bro. <laughs> Fire, bro. I ain't gonna lie to you, man. My man, my man said to be doing his damn fucking thing with this shit, bro. I love it. I love it. Jansom is fire. He's fire. Like, comment, subscribe, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm going to talk to you guys in a minute. I got more coming. <laughs> I'm going to talk to you guys later. Peace. I got a bad feeling about